Hi friends, Miggy from Figma here, and today we're going to talk about multi-edit and applying transformations across multiple frames. So you'll see here we have three frames on this canvas. I'm going to select this first object. I'm going to come up here and choose Select Matching Layers. You can see that this has been selected across all three frames, even though some of the properties may have changed. If I change the rotation here, you will see that the shape responds relatively across each frame. Let's try that with this hexagon. So same thing, I'm gonna select the hexagon, I'm gonna choose select matching layers, and this time I'm gonna hold the shift key and scale this, and you'll see that even though across each frame, that hexagon is slightly different, it's going to adjust. Let's try this out. I'm gonna select this shape, I'm gonna choose select matching layers, I'm going to hop over here to the rotation and I'm going to select zero for the rotation. And you'll notice that the rotation has been set for each of those objects. Let's do the same for the hexagon. I'm going to select the hexagon. We're going to select matching objects across those frames and change that mixed value for its rotation to zero. So that's one way to begin to normalize those values. Let's take a look at a smart animate example. So here we have three frames in a prototype and it's animating the rotation just like this. Now what we can do is when we're in design mode, we can select one of those objects. We can choose the matching layers and the matching layers are going to be important for that smart animate to play through correctly. And here I can begin to change some of those values. I'm going to hold the shift in the option key or the shift in the alt key. If you're on windows, I'm going to scale this up and down and you'll notice that those values scale uniformly when i begin to rotate this you'll see that each of the additional frames are adjusting in a relative manner i can also add to the mixed value so if we go here to rotation i can select that input field and put in plus 45 and you'll notice that it will apply to each frame relative to its current position once again let's select this frame i'm going to hold down the shift key you will see the matching layer hinting across those other frames and i can click drag and easily select and then i can make my adjustments let's scale that down i'm going to select this frame press shift spacebar and you'll see that our animation is intact we are able to edit it pretty easily. Once again, that's applying transformations to objects across multiple frames. Please check out additional videos in this multi-edit series, as well as the multi-edit playground on Figma's community. Take care and happy designing.